The pandemic triggered quarantine left college football coaches with the luxury they don't often have a lot of free time. Some coaches are vacationing on the beach, but for the reigning college football champions, LSU's head coach Ed Ogeron has decided to spend his free time in the ring. Joining me now from LSU country is Glenn West and SI's national college football writer, Ross Dellinger. Glenn, Coach O has found another love besides football. He's spending six hours a week training to box. He's used to coaching a title-winning football team, but now he's the student in the ring. Yeah, and I, I think that just kind of points to the work ethic that Coach O has kind of established here since 2017 when he took over. You know, this is a guy who loves to be in the uh, in the facility with his coaches and with his teammates and, uh, you know, with his players. And I guess kind of, you know, when that is taken away from him, he – he wants to, you know, focus and work on some extra things, you know, on himself. And, you know, that's it was a great point that Ross made in the in the in the story, you know, about, uh, you know, Coach O, you know, wanting to better himself by, you know, working on his on his body and 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 finding an extra hobby to kind of keep himself motivated and how it's helped him become a, a better coach at the end of the day. So, you know, it's just something that, you know, I think, you know, he needed for the quarantine. I think it's something we were all searching for, you know, as 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 the months waned on and you know, it was it was a, a great a great piece and a great uh, you know way for him to you know kind of stay active. Yeah, what a great use of time! I love that he's choosing to do this. Ross Oderon is turning 59, but his trainer L.J. Morvant said he's pretty good at boxing, which means a lot from someone who's trained some of the best boxers in the state. Morvant is a Louisiana native and a big LSU fan. How has his experience been training the head coach of the national champs? Yeah, he said it was pretty surreal, you know, early on. You know, he he cleared out uh, his boxing club in Baton Rouge just for Coach O uh, three nights a week. So everybody leaves, and it's just him and Coach O in the ring together. And he said at first it was surreal, and now he just thinks of uh, Ed Orgeron as just another one of his pupils, training another one of his guys. But this story has a little uh, personal aside to it. You know, Morvant has uh, three or four children, and, um, you know, they, they kind of resent boxing uh, because daddy missed so much when they were younger. Their dad missed so much in their life, uh, you know, youth t-ball games and things like that because he was boxing. So they resent the boxing a little bit, but not anymore, he said. You know, when he started uh, getting his new pupil into the facility and started telling his kids, oh, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm coaching the Coach O, uh, all of a sudden his kids got back into boxing and, and certainly there, a lot of them are LSU fans. So it's, uh, as he said, it's kind of redeemed himself with his children, which is kind of really cool. So cool. I read in your piece, Coach O actually called one of his children to congratulate him on a new job. And I mean, how amazing is that? Guys, thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate your insight on this. Sure.